My husband's the oldest of three boys. He had a standing invitation to his folks that anytime they wanted to, they could come and live with us when they felt the, the time was ready. They came down in April of 2014, just a few weeks shy of my mother-in-law's 88th birthday. <laughs> my husband Stephen got a hold of Dr. McGill and asked him if he would be willing to take his parents as patients, and he graciously accepted. So as a family physician, I oftentimes have the ability to take care of extended families. And in Eileen's case, I was taking care of Eileen, her husband, and her parents. And since I was already a patient and using my chart, they made me proxy to their records. Through proxy access with my chart, multiple family members can have access to the, to the patient's chart and improve communication within families that are taking care of patients. Using my chart is a snap once you know what you're doing. <laughs> I primarily use it as a tool of communication. I would send messages back and forth. We were also able to uh, have prescriptions refilled and all their, their test results were there. And that was beneficial for um, my mother-in-law who had her blood tested every week and we could keep track of it. I think one of the things I really appreciate about my chart was the convenience of staying at home and getting the care. My chart offered a way for Eileen to ask her questions without necessarily having to bring her parents into the office for a visit. So it offered a lot of convenience and, and peace of mind and comfort for Eileen. Using my chart did make caring for mom and dad easier, just, just in the fact of transportation alone. The time that we spent loading up and unloading and getting to the doctor's office and loading back up, you know, um, not being able, not having to do that all the time because I could just do it by using my chart. It free, that freed me up to spend more time with them in, in the house and doing things that you know we enjoy doing together.